Welcome back, guys, to our playthrough of Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. Okay, so we woke up somewhere in Tibet. It's actually a really cool area, but uh, we don't know where we are. But then Tibet, Himalayas, I don't know, geography, snow, mountains, oxen, people that speak. Does anyone speak English? Not English. I knew it! English, do you? I knew there was a treasure back here. Great stealing from the villagers, villagers basically. They wouldn't have you find a treasure in their house and take it, would they? Imagine we're just walking through and there's like a treasure in here, we just take it. <laughs> I mean, we are thieves, I guess. If these are good people, we wouldn't do that. I don't know. I got it, follow you. Go somewhere. Let's see if we can get our bearings. It's a really cool place. I bet it's cold as hell though, but it's really cool. I mean, it can't be that cold if the chickens and whatever live up here, right? Excuse me. Same. What? This is a pretty big place for us not to get into a huge gunfight, right? I'm just looking around for treasure right now. Let's see what's up this way. Weird that he would say that, right? Oh, I thought maybe he'd grab onto that. Oh, well, let me jump on that. Probably shouldn't jump around like that after, uh, you know, getting shot so recently. Hey, how are you, fella? Should have got an achievement for that. Interacting with that thing. There has to be treasure up here, right? I was too close to that ox or the bull or whatever that is. Bison, I'm not sure. I don't know animals. Uh. One of these houses has to have a telephone. Oh, I didn't even see that one. I was just walking by and it popped up. I didn't even notice a sparkle there. Uh. Excuse me, oh. gentlemen. Hi. Uh, you have a cell phone? Oh, cute. Hey, you're a young chingaman. Oh, cute. Mansu, you need to go to the house. Tom, you have to go to the house. I know he's back there. I'm just looking around. I see you two hiding. Oh. <laughs> I thought I saw a twinkle over here, but. Erp. Oh, I guess he was. Okay. 
Just when I thought I had nothing left to lose. Nate! What the oh heck? Oh my god, you're all right! <laughs> I'm sorry, I... It's all right. Elena, tell me you have some idea of what's going on. I mean, how long have I been here? Hey, only a few days. I followed the tracks to the wreckage. What the hell happened? Uh, you were right about Chloe. Turns out she wasn't exactly looking to be rescued. Wait, did she do no, that? No, no, I have Flynn to thank for this. Chef of Godesha. Yeah, yeah. Me, I got too soon. Come on. There's somebody who's anxious to meet you. I had a raspberry before recording this. Got stuck in my retainer. Oh, so, our mysterious guest awakes. Nate, this is Carl Schaefer. How are you feeling? Good. Thanks. Good, good. Please, sit. It appears you and I have much in common, Mr. Drake. Is that so? Yes. Seventy years ago, I came here just like you, carried into the village near death, the last survivor of my company. I was hired to lead an expedition into Tibet to find the entrance to Shambhala. What they really wanted was the Chintamani stone. How old is this guy, 120? So, my friend, where did you find this? Borneo. Why? This is the key to Shambhala. Duh. It's the one object your opponent desperately needs, even if he does not know it yet. <laughs> well, I think he knows. Look, I'm very grateful for everything you've done for me. I really am, but I'm through with all this. So, they have beaten you, huh? Your quest is over? Yeah, that's right. What if it's only beginning? <laughs> Where did you find this guy? <laughs> Here. <laughs> Trust me, young man, your ego will mend. You're just lucky to be alive. Yeah, you know, people are always telling me how lucky I am. But the truth is, everything I touch turns to shit. Nate. No, Elena, I'm done. Now, come on, I'm through playing the hero. Your adversary will not give up so easily. He will not stop until he possesses the thing he desires. Oh, yeah? Well, more power to him. Power is precisely the problem. <laughs> Some of the most fearsome rulers through history have possessed only a fragment of the Chintamani stone. Men like Tamburlaine, Genghis Khan. If a mere sliver could bestow such power, what would a man become if he possessed the stone itself? This is crazy. It's got to be what he's after, Nate. Then Lazarevich really is a nut job. He's chasing a myth. And what if he's not? Uh, Helena, come on. Well, I mean, what if it's true? We've seen what he's capable of. I understand your doubt. You require proof. Something you can see with your own eyes. Tenzin. Find the remains of my expedition, and you will have your proof. Tenzin will guide you. Tenzin totally speaks English, right? He looks like my custom sure. character in Red Dead Online. I hope I live to regret this. Come back in one piece. He's like almost bleeding, bled out. I suppose you speak any English, do you, pal? Yeah, you should have asked. <laughs> That'd been really funny. I would have died. <laughs> well, this looks inviting. What's it say? Why do I ask? Yeah. I'm not so good with charades, pal. Wait. Tenzin. Why do you need that? All right. And that's a wrap on chapter 16, which was mostly just cutscenes. Okay. Thank you for watching this episode of the playthrough. We will continue with a new episode tomorrow at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time right here on the Mark 9 channel. New episodes debuting daily at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. Before you go, show some love. Hit that like button. Do not forget to subscribe.
any feedback for me, leave it in the comment section. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Otherwise, just know I appreciate you and your time, even though about only 10 minutes of it this time. And I hope to see you when we continue with Uncharted 2 Among Thieves. All right, guys, that's it for me. Take care. Be well. I'll see you later.